Oh, sister, I was so tight I couldn't walk. You were what? I do like the um playing older games. Like I know it's probably not gonna like do well, but it's enjoyable. I mean these are classics though, like it's not like a like something that no one liked. Like this is one of the, like the OG classics that was on Xbox 360, PlayStation 3, stuff like that. And oh, oh nice. Okay. I would do that. If you denied me Applebee's, that's what I would do. Yo, Kowski, you have yeah. a new case. Two women, possible drink drive. How was that a case? The broad says she was doped and that somebody tried to kill her. Where did this take place? That's the bitch you're gonna love. Right across the street. What? <gasps> what? The Chevy Styline took a nosedive off the escarpment, fetched up underneath a Cola King billboard. Up to it, boys. We got bad guys to catch. Up to it, please. This guy gave his wife a tap. Say all's fair in love and war. See you later, fellers. <gasps> Try not to work too hard. See you later, fellers. <laughs> Her face looks familiar. Well, that's June Ballard, <laughs> Tarzan's sister, beast of the Amazon. What? She's married to Guy McAfee. The captain has moved to Vegas now, but the two of them still have Tarzan's juice. in here? Um, Phelps, traffic. Detective Phelps. Hey, Bukowski, long time no see. You could have called this in by megaphone, Enrique. <laughs> Phelps, this is Enrique Gonzalez. Enrique was a pretty decent middleweight. What do we have, Gonzalez? Broad drives right through the empty lot and off the side of the escarpment. Her story is that a movie producer doped her and her friend and sent the car over the cliff. Was anyone hurt? Driver's beat up. Not too bad, considering if she hadn't hit that billboard, we'd be scraping both of them off the pavement. Passengers are Jessica Hamilton. She's just a kid. She's pretty knocked around. Kid gonna be all right? I think so. They've taken her to Central Receiving. If you want to take a look around, stall the ambulance. Thanks. Do that. One more thing. Watch out for the driver. She cuts rough. What does freaking cut left, rough right. mean? So get out of my lens. Uh, if you're looking cut for the grass. coroner, he's down by the crash site. We would like to ask you a few questions, if that's okay. I prefer to use my maiden name, June Ballard. You might be familiar with some of my work. Can you tell us what happened here? You're kind of cute for a cop. Maybe a bit on the serious side. What about me, June? I'm a big fan of you? Beast of... I don't like. Keep out of this. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's take a, take a gander at her. So she does like a little... She's a little, a little smug. She's like... A little flirtatious in the eyes. Do you get paid by the hour for doing nothing? And she's a little bit of a snarky little rat, too. All right. She looks so old. How old do you think she is? 40. I think she's like... 62. That. She's 41. Okay, well. She's an old looking 41 year old. Alright, you remember that face? You got it? Yeah. Cleared it? Do you get paid by the hour for doing nothing? Alright, shut, shut, shut up. How do I. How do I. Blake! We understand that you're still suffering from the effects of the accident, Mrs. McAfee. The officer says that you claim that you were drugged. But who did this to you? That rat slipped us a Mickey Finn. It's no I wonder I feel so dopey. <laughs> I can't remember. Ah. Uh... Oh, she I think she I think this is a doubt. doubt. This is definitely a doubt. It's a serious offense to withhold information from the police during a criminal investigation, madam. I told you to call me June. You're making me feel like an old lady. <clears throat> and don't bother your handsome head about this. My husband will settle the score with Mark Bishop. <clears throat> That's how I feel better. Mark uh, Bishop. All right, let's look at her face now. So is this? So like, this is her new truth face, no? Like, now she's annoyed. So now this is her <sighs> new truth face. Do you get paid by the hour for doing nothing? I hate her. I think this is. I hate the mouse in this game. The, the mouse in this game really Literally, me. it looks like there's like a little pocket in there. Yeah. It's, a lot... it's like forced to open. Yeah. Okay. 
So she looks okay. Okay, 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 okay. Shh, 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 shh. Truth face. One, two, three. Got it. Boom. You mentioned a Mark Bishop. You think he might have had something to do with this? He is a movie producer. As for his involvement, you just leave it to me and my husband to worry about. So. I think this is a truth. <laughs> I hope, I think it's true too, but it makes no sense. It makes no. That answer is literally a threat. But yeah, we're gonna be like, yeah, all right, yeah, she's telling the truth. We're gonna let her leave it be. This is a wow. Okay, and I hate how she like no, talks. But I mean, she like... talks with duck lips. She goes, ah, ja, 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 ja. <laughs> That's how she talks. No, I think it's truth because you're like. Yeah, but your husband. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, okay, okay. I think it's truth, too. It's not going to play that way, Mrs. McCaffrey. We'll take it from there. What? <laughs> what? You're not nearly as cute when you're mad. Okay, okay, okay. I think. I'm, I'm going to tell you what I think. This I'm going to tell you what I Trump's think. Shut up, Bukowski. I'm going to tell you what I think. Shut, shut up. Okay. What I think was, was my theory was right, that when you look up at them, that's their new truth face. Like her, like, so whenever she went from to that, that was her, that was her little, little doubt face. Plus what she yeah, said I was know, really so freaking dumb, sus. Man. So I, I wonder, know, it just doesn't make sense. So I wonder if it's like the truth face can change if they're saying something like really freaking sus. Like, they can keep a truth face, but if they're saying something that's obviously, like, what the frick did you just say? Then? I don't know. I don't know. Are we going based off of faces or off of... I names? don't know! I think I'm gonna look that up. Hold on. Let me let me Google. What what are we actually basing it off of? Elian Noir. How to tell truth versus doubt. It's facial expressions that's the tutorial. If someone comes right at you with an answer and looks you straight in the eye, most likely they're telling the truth. But she was saying something really sus, I guess. Oh my gosh. All right, whatever. We got stuff to look at if now. You ask them questions and they move their head around looking all the place, but you do not have any evidence supporting your theory. Use doubt. Oh. That we, that are, we already knew. I already yeah, knew that. Yeah, I know, but like. All right, all right, all right. You'll want to see this, Phelps. There, <gasps> laid out on the trunk. And that isn't even the best part. Okay. Oh, so this person said that if you want to get like a little freaking like a, a lie, like kind of quote unquote hint, is you you choose lie and then Cole will say something like, "I can prove we found the murder weapon at your house," and then you don't have the evidence, you could back out and choose something else. Yeah, like if you think it's a lie, but you need to know, figure out what specific evidence. I know you could back out. I don't know. It's the whole truth versus doubt. But look. Corey, Corey. Escándalo! Oh, nice. Panty raid. Panty. Why are they ripped? Oh, gosh. They've been torn off. Where did you find them? They were stuffed in the young lady's handbag. I'll run a trace for semen when I get back to the lab. Did you rip these panties off of her, Corey? Did... Potentially with my main hands. <laughs> With your, with your sausage My finger, small hands. hands. Yeah, sausage finger, small man hands. Ew, look, I like the physics on them. Ooh. Anna says she lost them. Sorry. Anna, come on, man. Find your underwear. Panty raid. Panty raid. What's this? Oh, I'm not reading all this. What? Please, please, dear, come home if you're worried about your father. Don't be always forgotten or always forgiven. He has a hot temper. No, you're not. She's a long way from home. You're a good, decent girl, De dear. <laughs> you got me for Hollywood. I was 15 once myself. All right, Camille Hamilton. You're loving Mother. Hamilton. 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 Don't correct me. Hamilton. That's it. There was literally stuff in that bag. Um. Uh... <gasps> Blood. Looks like they're lucky they weren't more badly injured. So what, did she like freaking headbang the window? Being yeah. relaxed, tense really? to the window. Really? No, not the window. So then what went through the bloody? 
that all about? Her face smacked the windshield or the freaking dash. Your face bloodies are like easy. So then, why? What's with the what's with the freaking glass breaking then? If it hits something hard enough, the glass will break. Actually, no, you're right. Yeah, she hit her head on the glass. There's blood dripping down. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So she glass. freaking flew. She was just like right through. All right, talk, talk. I'm talking to you now. The core Run driver. Maybe not. How so? What's, What's wrong with Bukowski? Well, <laughs> yeah, it's corner. See what you think. <laughs> Alas, poor Yorick. I knew him, Horatio. Oh, he was crowded. Is it real? No. I think it's supposed to be a replica of an Indian truck and head. It's some kind of curio or movie prop. See the casting marks? Uh, casting, See the casting marks? Oh. Uh, made from. Yeah. Plaster of Paris would be my first guess, then paint it. So we can rule out the murder angle? No, you can rule that in. That thing was wedging the accelerator to the floor. Whoever did it wanted these women dead. Ooh, Mamma Mia, Papa Pia, we got a murderer. We speak to Ballard again. Oh, I see the casting marks, by the way, the, the, the line. Uh, oh, cat. Yeah. I, I was thinking cast, like, here's the movie cast of these people. I don't no, know. No, I was thinking of, like, freaking Made in China. <laughs> like, <laughs> really dumb like that. <laughs> Y'all are so nosy. Get out of here. This is not even like anywhere where people should be. It's a parking lot. This is like Make Out Mountain. Make Out. Make Out Reef. <laughs> Gosh. Injured female pa Okay, truth face. Smug little rat. Got it. What can you tell us about the passenger in your car? Jessica Hamilton. Poor Jessica. It's been a rough day for her. She's desperate to break into movies. What more can I say? That's a doubt. That's a doubt. Look at her. Look at her. Yeah. Look at her. Look at her. Look at her. How old is Jessica? Maybe Mrs. it was Bally. lie because we I made might have that evidence. Jessica I'm is. so done. I'm old enough, so done. Oh, we do have evidence. You're right. Oh, I don't want to. I want to restart so bad. Restart. No, I'm not doing that. All right. Holding little smile face is now occurring, probably because she got away with a lie. Yeah. Do you get paid by Shut the, the hour for doing nothing? Shut up. We found a shrunken head. It was used to tamper with your car. You see, I normally don't drive <laughs> off cliffs. The last thing I remember is getting behind the wheel. Uh, uh, that, that, press lie, press lie, because either lie or doubt. Let's see what yeah. evidence. Okay. Drugged. Uh, well, the oh, drugging no. aligns with her. Yeah, so not I mean, remembering. back out. And then just do, um. It's, it's literally out. like. Because oh, she no. could have been behind the wheel, but it doesn't mean she was. Driving it, quote unquote, doubt. So it's a doubt. Yeah. But what are we doubting? She's just saying the truth. You found a shrunken head. It was used to tamper with your car. You see, I normally don't drive off cliffs. The last thing I remember was getting behind the wheel. What is so doubtful about that? Do you choose truth then? No. No, pick truth. Pick truth. Pick truth. Because I, I normally am wrong at this. Can you do another intuition? I mean... Mm, I don't know. I'm heading both at the same time. You don't remember where the it's head down. came from? I don't know anything about a head. Why is everybody talking about a goddamn head? Isn't anyone interested in how I am? No. Restart. Literally, Restart. no. No. Mrs. We McCaffrey. have to commit. I think you would We're bad detectives. We're committing. We're just. Gonzalez back to the receiving hospital. I'm being taken in. You could say that. On what grounds? On the grounds that you are under the influence of narcotics and that you are withholding information from the police. My husband is going to want a word with you, Sonny Jim. Sonny Jim. What the frick is your husband going to do? I'm an officer. Yeah, my son, my, my husband's going to have a word with you, Sonny Jim. <laughs>
Oh my gosh, you're gonna kill someone. Oh my god. Well, good, good trip. There's a pole there. See, <laughs> they, they found, they knew about your schemes and they put a pole there this time. They didn't put a pole here. <laughs> oh, he just, <laughs> he just assaulted. Go. Her blood is on the floor. Oh my gosh, ma'am. All right. Oh, there's people down there. There's people down there. Ah! Christ the Lord! Oh, the police! Oh, the police! Where? Uh, uh, oh, oh, bro is... <laughs> okay. Bro needs to get to work. <laughs> yeah, he's late. I'm the best driver. Hello? Alright. 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 <laughs> DJ's so who is this? The son, other victim? Eric. Hello, Detective Phelps. Here to interview a Jessica Hamilton. Jessica Hamilton. Oh yes, she's in the room right behind you, Detective. That hat is fire. I want a hat like that. No, I don't need to be manhandled by a doctor. I need my. <gasps> it's the lawyer. old hag. Hey, where is the telephone? Do you know who I am? T. Hello. Feeling better since this morning, Jessica. Gosh, she's Hello. so young. My head still feels swimmy. Is there anything here I can look at? I don't think either of these actually matter. This is all doctor stuff. Yeah. No, that an eraser. <laughs> anything here? Mystic Tales. I would read I this. It. Invasion of Utopia. Six cents. Hello, Jessica. Uh, my name is Cole Phelps. I'm a policeman. I'd like to talk to you about your accident, if that's okay. Um, okay. How old is this kid? Fifteen? What is a fifteen-year-old doing? Why is her underwear out there? <laughs> oh, this is sad. I don't like this anymore. Okay, this is her truth face. Concern. Brows are furrowed. She's got a little stank lip going. She's got a big nose. Got it. Can you tell me what you remember about the crash? It's all kind of fuzzy. I remember waking up here. Nothing happened yesterday. All right, well, we know she's freaking lying. <sighs> what do we say? Well, I guess we should accuse lie. Uh, 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 oh. Uh... Mm. I think we accuse a lie here, because if not, we could switch to doubt. Tell the truth, Jessica. Why the big cover-up? I'm not lying to you. Underwear? Underwear or drugged? Oh, forcibly removed, I hate it. It's, it's either drugged or underwear. Observe. Obviously, she's lying. She's obviously lying. Yeah, but do we have the right proof? I think we do. It's one of these two. It has to be. You can do underwear. Doping. See, this is only about the driver. Yeah. Because this driver of crashed vehicle alleges doping. Unless she claimed that they're both they were You're both doped. Comfortable. Just I'm going with underwear. Here. Underwear. Not yes. Yeah. We found your underwear in your handbag, Jessica. You need to tell us what happened. The doctor told me what happened. I, I didn't want that. I just wanted to be a star, to be in movies. I told Junie what happened, and she told me to toughen up. That that was the price of stardom. Oh, Did she now? My gosh. Cold hearted bitch. It's not Junie's fault. It's not my first time. I had a boyfriend back home, but my father found out about him. Even if you consented, Jessica, <laughs> he just you're got still murdered. <laughs> my, my father found out about him. Yeah, now he's dead in a ditch. <laughs> yeah, now that's a different investigation. All right, now she's all uncomfortable, shifty-eyed. Shifty -eyed. We need to get in touch with your parents, Jessica, to tell them what has happened. Oh, you don't need to worry them. They sent me along to stay with Aunt June. They trust her to take care of me. All right, can we get a little run back on that letter? Because I think you're lying. You're a liar. 
You literally- Letter from mother. Lie. Well, press lie. Just press lie. Just press lie. Just press lie. I- I mean, we gotta- Press lie. I mean, does it- does the- does the letter say anything about her aunt? You know You can- you can back out if anything. You're lying, Jessica. How are we gonna make this right if you lie to us? Please, detective, why would I lie to you? You just lied to us five seconds Please, ago about your sex, you? okay? Letter from mother. Because you're a runaway, Jessica, and you don't have your parents' permission to be here. Now, do you want to tell me what really happened? I went with Junie to this strange place. It's difficult to remember. Someone gave me a drink to calm my nerves, and then I felt faint. So they drugged and raped her. Cool. Great. I think I must have passed out. This is, this is a great first case to be on. I feel disgusted. I feel bad for this fake child. Association with the bishop? How did you meet Mr. Bishop? Well, Junie is a big movie star. You probably know that. She's doing a new movie. There's no, I mean, there's no doubt in that. She's literally just, well, now she looked away. Just, now I'm No, freaking... now she is spitting. Like, she's just like, spitting. She's just telling the truth? We're, we're telling the truth? All right. Hold on, hold on. What no, she wasn't. Know? I never said anything. It was, said your anything. it was your okay. fault. It was your fault. Do screen test. It was your fault. I'm the one wearing the detective jacket. The you ain't wearing anything, all right? I don't want to hear it. No, okay. Evidence of criminal abuse. I mean, that's, like, obvious, no? <laughs> I know what happened to you, Jessica. Where exactly did it take place? Please. It's scary. It's really difficult to think of anything. I think this is a doubt. Doubt. We don't have evidence for it. Or intuition. Someone tried to kill you, Jessica. Do you Even get it? Okay. Forget about being in movies. It's time to act like a grown-up. I had to wear a robe and lay down on a stone. There were lights, a camera. It's not my fault. I'm not a bad girl. Why are you trying to hurt me? Thank you, Jessica. You've been a big help. Here's my card. If you think of anything or you need some help, just get in touch, okay? Okay. We suck at this. I, think it might be Gosh, I don't want to hear it. To better, I don't Jessica. want to hear it from you. I couldn't do that, officer. What if I got the part and I wasn't there? You're 15! Go home! And you're in a hospital. You're supposed to be freaking eating Pop-Tarts and drinking Kool-Aid. What the frick? It's the tale of this town, Cole. Lambs that go willingly to slaughter. Who the hell is that? That's Bishop. Must be her lawyer. He certainly expedited oh, her mind. release. I don't like it, Cole. Why is she in such a hurry? We should follow her. All right, your job. I'm done. Hey, that's our car. There she goes. Come on. No, our car. All right, so you're tailing her, right? Yep. Oh, 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 oh. You've got a pretty okay. funny idea of what keeping a low profile means, Phelps. Like, I don't know. Like, it doesn't, for me, it's just Ballard's not that obvious. Something. I would be a horrible detective in real life. There was just like, that was just such a blunt answer, you know what I mean? Yeah. Do you want to look it up real quick and see what it was? What the it's probably was. lie. She and then you would do the whole drug accusation. Because that was the criminal activity. Yeah, we asked her where was the place that she was at. That know. is drugs. Hey, too close, Phelps. Way too close. I mean, what's this case called? Do you remember? What are you doing? Are you trying to kiss their car? More than just kiss it. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. That would be a bad time to... Good job. Oh my gosh, Fallen Idol, there you go. There's <laughs> You're welcome. I figured it out. Oh my gosh. What? It's the tale of this town, Cole. What? That go willingly to Truth? Slaughter. Who the hell is that? Didn't we not? Did we lawyer. click truth Certainly or did we click doubt? I clicked doubt. I don't I like it, doubt. Cole. Why is she in such a hurry? We I did. Follow her. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was true. And an association with the bishop was doubt. There she goes. Come on. 
I was like, oh, it could be lying. I was like, wait, eh. And then you clicked something. And I was like, okay. Oh, Close. You're, close. You're getting too close. You're getting too close. Mallard is definitely up to something. Is this the one where we go back to the movie set? Might be. Because it seems like stuff happened at the movie set. I mean, the girl said she wore a robe there. She seems to have made a remarkably speedy recovery. What is that? Some sort of cold? This is so slow, I hate it. There we go. We get green three out of four rounds. Oh! You've got a pretty yeah, funny good. idea of what keeping a low profile means, Phelps. Greater movie season. 99 cents for a family ticket? I don't Get in there and see what she's up to. Oh, 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 oh. Are you doing it? She wants a five-star goddamn wedding. <laughs> 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 Is she gonna make a call? Also, how is the lawyer okay with this? Because the lawyer's right behind you, no? Ooh. <laughs> oh, it's sent to crouch at the freaking thing! If you have to do that entire chase again... Okay, so yeah, I, I guess it. you have to go, it. You have to go it. inside. You have to listen to the conversation. Get in there and see what she she's up to. She looks so annoyed, too. God damn it all, I asked them to hold the mail. How is this gonna work? Dude, look at that freaking neck. Alright, now. Now, 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 now. Baby. No, I don't want him taught a lesson. You know what I want. Well, then make someone else do it. You still know people out here, don't you? Then make some calls. I'm going to be very clear about this. You get this done, or I'm... Wilson's Hotel. Mr. Mark Bishop, that son of a bitch, lives in apartment 803. Sure, I got the film. No, we're not doing... We're just... So I guess she's trying to hire a hit on the bishop? I guess so. With the- yeah, with so the- what's the story? I've been. I'm guessing she didn't stop for light refreshments. She made a call. Sounds like Mark Bishop has a heap of trouble headed his way. I've got an address. Wilson's Hotel- Why is my mouse keep clicking off? off? Oh shit, but you better step on it. If he's got any sense, he'll be I as far away from home as I possible. got it. If you had any sense, you would have tried bumping up full guy speed. his wife in the first place. Good? Alright. Woo! That's right. Uh, oh, okay. Hopefully the game Maybe audio is walking. not too loud, because it looks pretty loud, man. Do the cops? I tried to stop them. It's, it's room 803, left out of the elevator. He's got blood on him! 
Man, those hitmans come out fast. Sounds like we're about to make it a hat trick of hysterical female witnesses. Golden knob! Give it up! Oh. LAPD! <gasps> They're hitting our girl? Yeah! 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 No! How do I dodge? I forgot. I forgot I had your children. No! Ow! You shut of a gun! Freaking get down! Go! There we go! We love very intense situations being uh, paused by a loading screen. Okay, that was so silent for no reason at all. Are you injured, Mrs. Bishop? I'm all right now. Those horrible, awful men. Perhaps you should sit down, ma'am. Yes. Yes. Forgive me, officers. I'm very flushed. I'll, I'll just sit down for a moment. That's perfectly normal, ma'am. Take a moment while we look around. Yes. She's pretty. Thank you. Just look at this mess. So I guess uh, Bishop wasn't here and they just started wrangling on her for no yeah. reason. Uh, nothing here. I'm not going to look at those wooden spoons because why would I waste my time? What? New Testament. Okay. Mm, my hat! Heck yeah. Oh, what's here? Does this matter? It doesn't give me anything to go on. Bedroom should. Ring? Wing? Probably not. Nope. Wedding ring would have been a scandal. Alright. Oh, a check. 20! What do you have to do to earn $20,000? Dang. I think a hundred something thousand is. I forgot what the number is. What is that? There we go. What is this? It would take a smarter man than me to connect that. Never mind. Uh, Actually, let's see. I'll only look at inflation calculator. Hold on. Okay, you look that up. I'm still looking around. Presented to Mark. Okay, I don't even know how that could be tied in as a clue. Money? Two hundred eighty-five thousand dollars, dude. <clears throat> nothing significant. What do you mean nothing significant? That's cash. Pocket that. Looks like the old movie set downtown. Okay. I doubt this has any meaning. Yeah, no. America's cookbooks. Interesting. Alright. I think that's everything except for this room. Not sure this means much. Nope. Alright. So we found a couple pieces of evidence. There's the set. Hollywood's own little piece of Babylon. Oh. That's really close by. Nothing here. Oh, there is something here. Interesting view. Looks like a mermaid in the background. Silver screen. Who are these men in the picture? My husband, Mark, and Marlon Hopgood. They work together on occasion. That's Hopgood's shop. Alright. And is that it? Eddie. I don't think so. Okay. 
Okay. That is the most blankest dead Can in- Can we get on with this, please? I don't like her either. She All had right. a reason to be upset. I mean, her house just got torn up, so. I guess. Those men, I think they work for Guy McAfee. Do you know the name? No. Why should I? June Ballard is married to Guy McAfee. Have you heard of her? That slut. <laughs> She's been badgering my husband for days. Mrs. McAfee alleges that your husband tried to kill her and her friend last night. I think you should tell us what you know. My husband's a movie producer. This has something to do with his new picture. He doesn't include me in his business. Uh. Uh. What? Okay, married, slut, badgering. Alleges husband tried to kill her. My husband is a movie producer. This has something to do with his new picture. He doesn't include me in his business. And then she gives that look to us? She's smug. Right? Uh, what's what's our notebook? Uh, I don't think there's anything about a lie. There's nothing that proves that. Oh, there's the evidence of her being criminally abused. Oh, we could have freaking. Ah. Oh. No, there's nothing that like proves that like she is part of the business. But can we get doubt? on with this, please? I'm thinking doubt. No. In intuition, intuition. We're gonna waste our last intuition on this? Yeah. Uh, so it's doubt. Doubt. June Ballard said she had a deal to be in his new picture. Mark repeatedly told her no. He had Joan Leslie lined up for the role. That's how he got the finance. June made all kinds of threats. She was very rude to me. You know June Ballard? We were both on the same picture a few years back. That's how I met my husband. Oh my gosh, we have a lot more. <laughs> okay, still straight face. Where can we find your husband, ma'am? He told me he would be on set. That's all I know. She's telling the truth. That's, that's, tr I mean, come on. That's the exact same face that she's been holding this entire time. Either we find him or McAfee's people do, Mrs. Bishop. If you care for him, you should make sure that we find him first. I do care for him, but I don't really know where he'd go if he were in trouble. Hopgood might know. Okay, recheck the face. Still the same kind of pissed off look. Why is your husband paying Lorna Hopgood $20,000? Lorna? Marlon's ex-wife? Are you sure? Is uh, it lie because we have the check? Uh, yeah, I would grand? assume. Like, what do you mean? Are you sure? Are you sure you yeah. didn't see the check in my floor in the bedroom? You're lying, Mrs. Bishop. It's some kind of payoff. You know exactly what the money is for and who it's getting paid to. Do I? Would you like to prove that, detective? Um, $20,000 check. <laughs> it's like, hmm, I wonder what my options are here. This is about, um... The reason why the check, didn't she just, like, she was saying... She said, are you sure you know that, like, who it's for? It's so Lorna, kind of, you know. Marlon's ex-wife, are you sure? You're lying. So it's you're saying job. to hit him with this check. You're saying to hit him with this check. What else would it be? Uh, is this your final answer? Yes. Your husband looks like a oh, big black man. Oh, wow, they listen to Corey for every once in a while. Wow, wow, wow it, it works. Why is the payment going to Hopgood and not McAfee? Is it McAfee Lorna a fire thing? Lorna works at a check cashing place in Hollywood. McAfee, yeah. You need to ask Hopgood why he needs that much money in cash. In cash. Abuse of Jessica, okay. Still, I don't know. I think oh, she's bad. the pretty. By the way, I think she's the prettiest character I've seen in the game. She's so the most far. normal looking character. She is so chill. I love the dress. Can we get on with this, please? I hate the attitude. I hear how well they did the freaking, like, the actual facial, like, the scrunching of the forehead yeah. and stuff like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. I hate it. It's, like, really well done. Your husband <clears throat> was at a casting yesterday with a young girl? Not that I know of. He told me he was looking at locations. The picture's been cast. 
<laughs> He's like, mm, I don't know. Uh, is this a doubt? Is this a doubt? Uh, I don't know. I think it's a doubt, honestly. It has to be a doubt. I don't think it's. I think... Oh, yeah, but what about the prophet? Uh... Jessica remembered yeah. a mermaid. The mermaid on the front of the prop store. You better come clean with me. This is a sick town, detective. Are you sure you really want to know? The truth is, my husband likes them young. Oh, nice. <coughs> That's I hate okay. it. I hate her. I hate this. I hate everything. I was 16 when I first met him. Oh my gosh. I thought he was a genius. A magician with film. I was 20 before I realized he was just a B-movie hack. But he's nothing compared to some of the monsters at these big studios. My guess is, Ballard sacrificed her little friend. Happens to a lot of girls. Uh, your husband this. is in trouble. This. It could go easier for him if you were more helpful, Mrs. Bishop. He's a big boy, detective. Yeah, so, intuition point, let's this go. This is Hollywood. There's always a deal to be done. It's only a deal to be done. All right, bye, lady. I love your dress. Whip it! Whip it! You... <laughs> you clipped him! <laughs> boobies! No, I don't want to look at the boobies. Okay, or look at the boobies. All right, there we go. <laughs> they're just kind of like, uh. <laughs> yeah, they're just like, hmm. I've seen better. Hello. Hello, Whoa. Polly Pits. Oh, Corey! Wilson Bukowski, <laughs> LAPD. We're investigating the attempted murder of June Ballard and Jessica Hamilton. Oh, Christ! Uh, I'm Marlon Hopgood. How can I help? You hold castings here? How'd you hear about that? I got a little soundstage out back. You like them young? The way. You sicko. No, it's not the one. That's not the one. That's not the one. That's not the one. What do you mean? We went to Hopgood Apartments and she said her husband likes him young. It's it's her husband. This isn't her husband. This is not her husband? No, this is Marlon um, Hopgood. This is his friend. Oh. My bad. My bad, G. Look at all these sets. Do they get messed up in the rain? This place is very nice. Keep him here, Stefan. I'm gonna take a look around. What's this got to do with me? Don't try my patience, knucklehead. <laughs> yeah, knucklehead. 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 What the fur? Turn off the lights, Hopgood. Why would I want to do that? Humor in. One way mirrors. There's a room on the other side. That's like the worst one way mirror I've ever huh. seen. Well, well. Find a way into that peep den, Phelps. I'll stay here and keep our. Oh, ah, wasn't this the thing that was missing? No, yeah. this is different. One of them, one of them. Oh, the hair physics? Uh. Ugh. <clears throat> Alright, but it doesn't count. That's not evidence. Uh, or unless this one, the next one's. No, it's probably not. What is this one doing here? What is going on? Why are they just, like, spread everywhere? Mmm, drugs. Drugs. Doping <gasps> a 15 year old kid and abusing her in a screen test. What is wrong with these people? And they recorded it! I hate this game. What's with all these heads? Mm. <gasps> so weird. Echo me. It can't be that way, Phelps. You couldn't fit a rat through there. Uh. What? Wouldn't be that way. Maybe there? Where? No, because that's the- this is our door. No, I'm saying like to the left- like outside the door to the left. Wait, hold on. Oh snap, I'm stuck. Oh wait, never mind. Oh. Yeah. A hairbrush? Not much help. That's like the worst hairbrush. How is that supposed to brush your hair? Another one. Oh. Junk. Junk. Alright. Junk. Um. I mean, it's right through here, though. 
Maybe there's like a other way in from like the other side. Uh, like outside? Maybe. Ah, oh, yep. Okay. <laughs> Was that beer? Nothing. Jeez. Ah, there's so many recordings. Jungle, Jungle drums. drums, Eighth and Francisco. Attention, Mark Bishop. Oh my gosh, that freaking thing outside rustling is gonna be. I hate it. What the fuck? That's no! Oh. Ew! Freaking disgusting! So what happened to the film of Hamilton's screen test? Maybe he still has it? What do they do? Sit here and drink and reminisce on their freaking disgusting deeds? saw this, how many budding starlets would still get on the bus to come to Hollywood. Okay. Do I... Why are we stuck? The best angle. Uh, so we can't even check the camera to see if it has film on it? Okay. So is that it? What is happening? <gasps> the bathroom. Bro! These guys are freaking disgusting! I hate everything, and those are all probably like different women. Ugh. All right, that's it. We're killing this guy. Imagine if we got the choice to do that. Throw him in this dumpster, please. Break his shins. What's something that's like really hard to heal? Break his elbow. Punch him. So she should ever do any work for Mark it. Bishop. Mainly do work for the studios. RKO Republic. Warner Brothers. So yeah, when Bishop is doing work for a studio, yes. When did you last see him? Now I'm doing work for his next picture. Still pre-production though. I haven't seen him around here in a while. I hate, I hate how he talks. I hate how this dude talks. What's, what's our evidence? What's our evidence? We haven't seen him in a while. Um. Bishop's whereabouts? Yeah. Is that? What? What do you mean? That's what's what. Bishop's whereabouts at the what bottom. You... What? That. Our evidence at the bottom. Oh. Hmm. I. Okay, so this is not Bishop. This is, what's his name? Gobbledygook. What is his name? Hopgood. Hopgood. Oh, my freaking knee. Um. He hasn't seen him in a while? Could this yeah. be true? Or, no, because the no, canister. No, it's out, right? Because the canister. Because they, ups, like, offend. What do you say? They, you know, did the deed on this girl and recorded it last night. No? You could hump a few props or sweep the floors if you got nothing better to do. Hmm. <laughs> I think it's honestly empty film cancer, but I don't want to say that because it might be doubt. Okay, 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 okay. We're gonna hit lie. I know you're lying, Hopgood. Bishop was here, and you know exactly what he was doing and what he left lying around afterwards. You come in here without a warrant, oh, and then you start throwing your weight around. Okay, okay. That has to be the film canister. Let me drag my mouse all the way down. I have a drugged yes. up 15 year old girl, and you have chloral hydrate in your drinks cabinet. You give me something, or I will break your fucking jaw, Hopkins. Break his elbow! Bishop was here with June Ballard and the girl. A, a lot of producers and directors use this place. I I'm not responsible for what goes on here. That's disgusting. McAfee's men are looking for Bishop. We need to find him first. Any idea where he might have gone to ground? If he really tried to kill McAfee's wife, my advice to him would be to leave town. What? 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 
If he really tried, I heard if you. McAfee's men are looking for Bishop. We need to find him first. Any idea we may have gone to ground. If he really tried to kill McAfee's wife, my advice to him would be would be to leave town. So he's, we're asking where he is, and he's telling us where he could go. So look at him. <gasps> what? That's the that's his truth. Me, I mean, he's giving the dead on look. Uh, intuition. <laughs> I'm not. You're delivering props hey. to the pros on Eighth Street. Bishop is using that old rundown wreck of a set. That place is dangerous. But it might be a good spot to hide. I hate how the, he, this, this guy, guy talks. Just, I hate yeah, this how this guy talks. He seems like a good guy. Like no, he's not. Um, I think how does he no, not but I think he genuinely doesn't know what happens on you could hump like, going a few on props back here. or sweep the floors if you got. He says hump a few props, and you're saying that he doesn't know what's going he on. Doesn't in say, here. He doesn't mean hump. He's like, doing literally some. Freaking dry hump a uh, 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 This is his hump. building. The floors, if you got he's got some hand. mirrors that are see through. He's watching people pee pee. I mean, if someone watched me pee from that angle, I mean, I'm facing the toilet with my pants like. He's not watching your booty. He's, looking he's watching at... my my butt doesn't go he's out of look... my pants when I pee. What's the deal with you and June Ballard? Look, buddy, I make props. I hardly ever meet the talent unless it's something tailor-made for them, like a sword or something. Okay, this guy, I think it's doubt. He's kind of looking off. He's yeah, looking he, off. like, this guy is so subtle with what he does. I think it's doubt. We have no proof of him, his relationship with Ballard, right? That's the freaking mm -hmm. lady. I don't think we have anything. We have the shrunken head, and he makes the props, but that doesn't prove anything. Yeah. Does it? Mm, no, it doesn't. What about I, this check? And that doesn't. What about the saddle? Yeah, I think it's a doubt too. Dang it! I keep hitting escape. Doubt. Ballard was out. Then she's in. Then Bishop visits this place and goes crazy. You're in it somehow. These clowns fuck young girls on the couch. The girls think they're gonna be stars. They really put their backs into it. It's a price they're willing to pay. None of them will press charges. That's all for now, Hopgood. We're taking. So, um, I would like a formal apology for the what fact that you, that you, no, 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 this isn't about what? that, this isn't about that, this is about your previous, this, shush, 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 this is about your previous statement, stating what? that you, that you, they, he didn't know what was going on here, and he just blatantly I said, he, yes, it does, it yes, it, it does matter. matter, he blatantly said that these guys frick young girls, he knows, he's watching them pee, he's recording it, that's probably his recording room, they probably think, I bet you that's what it is, that this is his recording room, and he's doing all this nasty stuff, well, the, these guys are just thinking that they're doing nasty stuff in secret. And he probably uses it to blackmail. Probably. You're uh, under arrest. Roy Earl, advice. Hold on a moment. This is clearly a vice case. You've been roughing up my informant? Hopgood is a vice informer? Yes, he is, Phelps, and a very important one. Look at that mug. Have you been upsetting these two officers, Marlon? So we just drop it? You do if you know what's good for you. You need to catch the movie producer before an angry husband does, from what I'm hearing. I'll be making a full report to the captain, detective. You do that, kid. We're all very impressed with you. Let it slide, Cole. Let's get out of here. What? What? Detectives. Johnny Goldberg. You work for Mickey C. That's right, detectives. You wouldn't happen to know the guys who roughed up Mrs. Bishop earlier today, by any chance? No, no. Not us. We don't do that kind of thing. It's the husband we'd like to talk to. This is a police matter. You don't want to be taken in for obstruction of justice, do you boys? You could try the obstruction rap, but uh, it won't stick. We could beat that. You've had your 10 cents worth, gentlemen. Bishop knows how the world works. Mrs. McAfee hits him up for a movie part. Happens every day. But Bishop takes it a step too far and tries to rub out Mrs. McAfee. 
Naturally, Guy is gonna get upset. What made you think Bishop would be here? We figure he might be planning a little accident for Hopgood, too. Those two guys have got some unfinished business. You let us know if you find Bishop. Guy McAfee can be a very generous man. I'm only gonna warn you once, gentlemen. Stay out of this. This is a police matter. We will be bringing Mark Bishop into custody. <laughs> At least he's polite. Kind of dumb, but polite. But I'm a lot less polite, you smug son of a bitch. So let me put it in ruder terms that even a pair of blockheads like you might understand. The only reason that you don't have bars on your windows already is because you're small fry. And we don't waste our time on small fry. You stay away from Bishop, and you stay away from me. Is that clear enough for you, asshole? Now run along back to your boss so we can pat you on the head and tell you what good boys you are. <laughs> oh, Neil. Adam Blake Bukowski. Bukowski. Adam Boy Bukowski. Let's go. Bukowski saying. Oh, shit. Get us out of here. Run. 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 Can't drive. Okay, I'll drive. I'll drive. Stop moving the mouse. They really don't want anybody to get this. I can't wait. Oh my gosh, you are obstructing justice, sir. You're obstructing our escape. Oh. Hello. We can't kill them. We have to run away. No. Is he dead or subdued? Evie. <laughs> Don't move the mouse! I'm gonna freaking murder you. I can't. I just suck. I can't hurt my friend. Keep it steady. I'll try and bust Keep his tires. Keep it tire. steady. Ah! There's a the slippery bastard now. No. God damn it! Why would you try hiding here? I got it, I got it. I got it, I got it, I got it. I got it, I got it. Oh my gosh, you ruined it. E Can we not aim our gun? Okay. This would be like the perfect time to aim a gun at this dude. Marine, we run so slow. I thought uh, Marines well, were supposed I mean, to run fast. I mean, you are wearing shoes like that. Like those shoes are not that far. How is he you running faster then? It's not. Over boy, your choice. I like I his suit though. Kind of want it. Can we rip it off him after? Alright, uh, you keep running after him. Beat him over almost done. Gosh. Oh my gosh! You messed this up! E. You're going down. Don't kick me. Ow! I said don't kick me. You're done for. Say your prayers. I'm gonna lie. Hey, where'd you go? Hey, 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 where'd you go? Hey! Gosh, you ran so far. You're not even no, doing- you're like doing a light jog! Oh gosh, oh gosh. Oh, There's some perfect timing about that wood falling. Oh, never mind. Ah! Oh, we did <laughs> What was that?! <laughs> oh, there, eight! Oh. Yeah, I got it, yeah. Mark Bishop, you're under arrest for the attempted murder of June Ballard and the rape and attempted murder oh. of Jessica Hamilton. All right, I'll come quietly. Just don't kill me. If you found me, then McAvee's goons will too. Oh, we need we need to get out of here. All right, but you stay close. Any tricks, and I'll save McAvee's boys the trouble. Follow me. I know another way out of this place. Let him die. He, he let, I would rather is let it him a gun die. Show? Yeah. This is my gun. This is, this is yours. Christ, detective, they're trying to kill me. Last chance to Honestly, they down. should. Deserves the 
Hey, you're getting shot at. <laughs> what? What was that? <laughs> he kind of just shot up in the air. LAPD, you're making a big LAPD. You can pick up their weapon. Don't forget. Serious? Yeah, I'm being serious. It literally like showed the prompt to pick up the weapon. Is it H? No. Oh. Q. Yeah. yeah God, he wants you to shoot the barrel. Else. The barrel. The There's no way out of here. I thought you said you knew where you were going. <laughs> we have to jump for it. Guys, this is so fit. He's so f like I find some cover. could never. You're dying. You're dying. You're losing color. I think you got him. Maybe I don't know. Shoot the barrel. Barrel! Shoot the barrel! For the love of God, I don't know how to Imagine you're supposed to wait and those actually people are gonna show up there now. Yep, they were. <laughs> I don't wanna die! You know? Don't waste your ammo! I have uh, infinite. Oh, do you? I oh. Guess. The statue there. There's a ladder leading to the ground. Dude, at least break this guy's this elbow whenever you're done. Whee! I had the best view, so. Get him over here, I'll cover you! Come on! The cavalry's here! Jeez, that sounds awful. I got my oh, what the What happened to your hat? Cassie, no! Oh my gosh. It's so loud. Well, that did it. Follow me. We need to get under the car. Gun back. Stay down. Gosh, you have so many bullet wounds oh, in you. Freaking like a Swiss cheese. Realistic. Get to the car. I can come to you yeah, no bleeding out here. <laughs> yeah, I don't think you want to shoot your. Oh my gosh, your buddies are getting shot. You killed him! You killed the cop! You ran into my bullet! You killed the cop! What do you mean? You murdered her! <laughs> the fast like now this is what I call a result. Mark Bishop, erstwhile film producer, an all-around piece of shit, catches a fast ticket to Quentin for statue rape and attempted murder. What the, so the blood? You saw the, the blood just slowly pool in the back? Instead of sticking it to little girls. Oh! That is justice with a capital J, Detective Phelps. You developed such a reputation, I'm not gonna be able to hold on to you any longer. You're getting promoted. Go on, get your new assignment. We got promoted! I like Bukowski though. Hug him. Oh, not even a little holy kiss. All the blood just randomly. <laughs> Vice? Are we doing Vice? I hate this guy's salmon suit. Phelps, Bukowski, this your work? 
Can I help you, detective? Sorry, Cap. Didn't see you there. Yeah, I'll bet you did. This is a traffic case. You need something? I'm here to buy a drink for the two LAPD traffic cops who broke the back of Guy McAfee's private army. You don't have a problem with that, do you, Captain? Go right ahead. Get in. I'm buying. I hate his suit. I really do. I think it's the ugliest suit ever. The color, that orange salmon color. That's what color, I want to wear. I like hate it. If I were, if I was mad at someone who died and I had to go to their funeral, I would You'll wear like that place. outfit. Lot of movie evil. <laughs> it's so like evil. Cool. <laughs> it's it. not. Sure. I guess. Big bands and swing, I can understand, but this bebop palaver? How are you supposed to dance to That's that? That tie is awful too. Okay, I gotta stop. We gotta listen. This is Phelps, Leroy. Be nice to him. You'll like this place. They treat you right. Like a table break. What do you think we want to do? Stand at the bar like I'll chumps? Get a table ready for you. Don't look so happy to see me, Alphonse. I might get the wrong impression. Cole, this is Alphonse. <laughs> He's a <laughs> French Negro from weird. Africa. Can He's you got Riz. Of Congo. A pleasure to meet you, Alphonse. Is Elsa singing tonight? There she is. She has the next set. Come on, Cole. You can meet Elsa while they're fixing us a table. You'll like her. She's something else. Maybe another night, Roy. She's pretty beat up about it. Get your hands off me. Don't ever tell me what to do or what not to do, Alphonse. You got a nice club here. Don't spoil it. If you will follow me, detectives. Uh, or just through the door. I don't know why, but this officer, whatever, who, who he is. was he's... my only real friend, Harlan. We went through it all. Do you realize what he <gasps> did to me? It's oh, him! You have no idea. You said it was construction work. It was an industrial accident, Elsa. How can I be held responsible? Elsa, are you going on? Louis forgot that he was my best friend. The only man who ever loved me without putting his hands on me. Aww. Hi, Elsa. Here's someone I'd like you to meet. Cole Phelps, war hero and crime fighter extraordinaire. And why would I want to meet another fascist from the LAPD? Sorry about this, Cole. <laughs> What an evening I'm having. First a Negro puts his hands on me, and then this. Oh you my think gosh! You're talking to you, German junkie whore. Don't you ever forget your place with me again. Do you hear me? Punch him in the balls! Hey, Doc. How's business? Sanguine. Louis, help me here. I'm gonna have to give her something before her performance. Blow oh it off, Cole. Oh my gosh. These artsy fartsy types always get a little flighty. Meet Dr. Harlan Fontaine, Doctor to the Stars. <gasps> Look at all the Mr. track marks on her arm. Wreckage of Hollywood. So what about that drink, boys? This is awful. I think we did pretty good on this case, though. Case notes: the case is thin without an account of Jessica's ordeal. From. I accidentally clicked it. 